still has some stuff. Hopefully we get something insane this duel. Obviously we're targeting good buddies for... You know, if anyone else gets something early from higher tiers, that's also another target. The battle for Alterac Valley begins okay, I'm definitely now. starting with this because I don't want to lose. I have a good feeling about that one. I mean, can still lose to a picky eater that eats a backstage security, but... I mean, what are the odds of that? Stay warm out there. You're an unstoppable force. Hmm. Oh, they both had these. I'm guessing it's the pup. But oh, in which case I might lose. Um I think it's probably still worth leveling. Even though we lose, sadly. It's probably a 4-5 now. Yeah. Oh, so we can tie. That's good. Rough battle, but let's see what we can do. Is it worth stealing from this guy? Undead. So I mean at this point it's probably. Hmm, this seems a little better. Well... Undead. Not a problem. Here's your goal. I'm gonna do this. Because I have a feeling it's not worth stealing from him right now. Plus eight. That's how it's done. I have my eye on you. It is adorable, just like a frost wolf pup. I just want to give this more health. Uh, So it can, I mean, it's only plus two, but should be better than nothing. You're on top of the mountain. Okay, just barely enough to win. Well, his buddy would have been good to have. Who am I going up against next? Okay, if it's Millhouse, uh, Mill I'm not going to play this right now. Let's see what he has, though. Does he have it? No, he doesn't have his buddy. Man. Okay, so we uh, actually, because of the text on this, we should do it like in this order. Elementals. Probably need more attack than. Worm already has his buddy, huh? Even though he's been losing? How did he get it to a fast? It's turn 5. And that should cost 17 or 15. Oh, he might have a really weak ward then. Terrible hit. Uh, 
another terrible hit. That's useless. Let's go that it doesn't way. it doesn't affect my hero power, right? Yeah, that's useless. Oh my god, that's so unfortunate. Okay, that's a triple. Which I'm probably gonna take next turn, right? Uh, I'm not sure if this is the right move. Oh, crap. Oh, he's gonna summon one more. Okay. Wow, that was crazy. That's okay. We all slip now and then. Does he already have his body? He doesn't have it yet. We could try to screw him over by... <laughs> um, us using his thing. Plus two attack is pretty good. I gotta say. Okay, those are all really bad. That's actually kind of crazy. Victory. That's how it's done. That doesn't work with my hero power. This is really bad against Undead, sadly. Um, Not a problem. Here's your goal. You sound like creaking metal. I'm gonna buy this just in case I can ru I run into a mummifier and I can use it on this. First place is yours. This calls for a celebration. That went pretty well, actually. <laughs> what a win. 
lantern lights. What does he have? Undead also. I'll take another one. Hard work pays off. Don't take Rakadishu, Rakadishu. I do think I want to play both of those right now. Our goal is to find Mummifier, because we only this is the only dead we have, so we can easily apply Mummifier to it, and then if we get a Kel'Thuzad, I think it's pretty much game over. Um, and we can keep these around to, like, buff the hell out of this. Well, although, we, it would be, we would need a gold in it. To, and find also, um... Uh, Yeah, it's a, it's pretty hard to set up actually. Now that I think about it, st definitely still doable though. Okay, so we lose this one. Against Millhouse. This is a bit of a delicate balancing act. Bye bye, Millhouse. Nice. Okay. That's exactly what I was aiming for. I was kind of hoping I would go against him next. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't hit any of the other undeads. That's great, though. We need Kel'Thuzad. Uh, it really just comes down to that. Or Mummifier.
Man. Not a problem. Here's your goal. Recruitment time. My favorite. Victory is near. Just a little bit more. You're an unstoppable force. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Mm, still no health is odd. I guess hateful hag. Oh, thank God. Um, so I don't need this anymore, actually. But uh, I still could use a mummifier if I can find one. Mm, no mummifier. This is it for uh, how this is gonna work out. Victory is near. Just a little bit more. That's a lot of stats, right? I mean every turn. Is this gonna lose to something like Oh he does have a Kelthazar, he just couldn't hit it. That's a lot of damage. Okay, this could actually be really insane. What does he have? It's kind of hard to say, to be honest, but I don't think it's worth wasting two gold. Oh, okay, so there's Mummifier, but the problem is... Okay, so I can do this. Um, just... Because I need two slots to be able to give it permanent reborn. With the disguised grave robber. I guess I don't really need the Chupacabras anymore. Because we're getting insane amounts of stats anyway every turn. Oh, 
Okay, that's crazy. I hope I don't mess this up. The re sometimes I get tr uh, confused by the reborn where it shows up. Okay, good. So I should have enough space. Yes, I do have enough space. Okay. Baron earlier? We could try try to steal his Chiron Ribbon there. There's nothing else on his board that I think we want though. I mean, we can probably still beat him with this anyway. Considering they tied, so they're at similar power levels. <laughs> God, what a what an insane board. Okay, that's exactly what I wanted. Look at the size of this thing, that's crazy. Okay, so the Reborn one appeared here, right? So we need to clear more space for that. Um... Well, this isn't golden yet, so we can't really apply Reborn to the new ones as well. This is a dead end. It should be fine. I mean, I'm sure there's a better way to do it, but... <laughs> oh my god. If we lose this, I'm gonna be really sad. Okay, there's like zero chance we lose this. I mean, that is a lot of stats, but unfortunately. I mean, our Baron is 4,500 and 3,500 attack, so yeah, that's pretty, uh, we, we, we did your build better, buddy. <laughs> 